ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがとうございます。ありがと
here is the dormitory for a university campus. Then usually right beside it, there are like other student hostels with like a lot of rooms for students who want to study temporarily or like who want to study for short term or long term. Uh, so there are a lot of options. And I, I heard that they are pretty cheap because for my dormitory, I pay like 400 United States dollars a month. Mm. And my friend who is staying at the hostel, she pays 300 United States dollars a month. Oh. No, I think it's cheap because oh. there's also ch kitchen and bathroom. Mm. Have you seen Muslim girls practicing hijab in Korea? This person is asking if you've ever seen a Muslim yeah, with a hijab, hijab yeah. mm. or if they practice Islam, mm -hmm. so you can see that they are. Ah, uh, they are. <laughs> yeah, I've seen many people who wear hijab, especially in Seoul. Yeah, there are many people who wear hijab, and I saw many. Would it turban? I saw many people who wear turban. 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 Like namja. Oh. Ooh. Wow. Have you ever think that you will stay at Korea for the rest of your life? <laughs> because you might marry a Korean guy too. <laughs> um, no, I've never thought of staying in Korea my whole life because my family lives in the Netherlands and I am very close to my family. So coming here for maybe like six months or one year is okay, but staying here forever is... Well, I don't think I can live without my family. And the question about the Korean guy, about dating or marrying a Korean guy, religion is very important to me and that is all I can say because I can never say that I will or won't. You don't know what the future holds, so... Mm. Uh, <laughs> can you speak Turkish? Oh, <laughs> no! So this person asks if I can tell you more detail about eating halal food in Korea and um, whether it is a problem to eat outside. And like we explained in our previous video, it is possible to find a halal restaurant. However, they are more expensive than uh, regular Korean restaurants. And um, about the alcohol, I would like to explain something because when Koreans gather, they usually drink a lot of alcohol, right? Yeah, right. So it's a way to grow closer to people. Mm. Usually when I meet with my Korean friends, we sometimes go to a place Thanks where they, place. Mm, they drink, but I don't drink. So I still go, but I just drink water or like cola mm. and they become crazy. And then I take care of them after we go. Mm. <laughs> but um, I mean, there is alcohol almost everywhere, but mm. uh, yeah, you have to find your ways. Yeah. Uh, so there's another Turkish question. This person asks if I miss the Turkish kitchen. I don't because there are Turkish restaurants here as well. I actually had kebab yesterday, so that was good. And also it's expensive to buy uh, food at a, at a supermarket instead of a restaurant. And I think it is more expensive to buy ingredients and to cook than to eat outside. Mm, yeah, that's right. How much money? Do you need for living in Korea for one month? Minimum 50,000, 60,000 because the grocery and food are not that cheap in Korea. I think it's a little bit hard to answer exactly because, like case by case, some people use a lot of money for one month and some people use really few money for one month. So I think it just depends on your sensei. <laughs> yeah, it, it depends on you. Mm -hmm. But I think minimum is like 50,000. Mm. Don't uh, want to be there. Okay, okay. My dad thinks Korea is not safe, so he don't want me to study there, but still I want to go. So, is it really dangerous? Okay, I can really answer. Korea is one of the most safe countries in the world. Safest, safest country in the world. It's really, really safe. Really don't have to worry. There are also a lot of policemen and CCTVs yeah, and yeah, right. cameras, so it's not dangerous. Mm. Yeah. Yeah. If you steal something, you will, go, you will be catched like in 10 minutes. <laughs> <laughs> oh, true. Mm. This person is currently a middle school student and he, she wants to have an internship abroad. Um, but is it possible to get work for three months? Mm. I can say getting a job in Korea as a foreigner is not easy. But if you try and if you really want to do, then you can find a job. They like people who take initiative. You can do it. Why not? Is it hard to apply as an exchange student in South Korea? If yes, does you need to be a super smart student with high marks or no? So to apply as an exchange student in South Korea is really easy uh, because they don't really look at your grades. Yeah, right. <laughs> When Koreans apply for university, they always look at grades, but when foreign people apply for exchange program, mm. 
they with us they only looked at motivation letter so yeah. if you write a good letter and of course you have to pass all your credits in your home university uh, then you can apply for uh, mm. university in Korea mm. you know the relative grading in South Korea I was like really in shock when I heard that ABC do we just have like from 1 to 10 and then you get what you deserve oh. In Korea, we, we give the grade like 5% A plus and well, 5% A and 15% will be plus like this, right? Mm. Yeah, in our country, Dutch. we don't have that. We just like, uh, you, you get a grade from 1 to 10. Passing rate is 5.5. Uh, and... <laughs> <laughs> so, yeah. <laughs> so, when you hang out with your Korean friends, how do you politely tell them that you can't drink alcohol? Because as long as I know that Korean culture is related to soju or something like that. Um, I always tell my Korean friends in advance that I don't drink alcohol and that I don't eat meat. So, uh, when we ag agree to meet somewhere, we mm. know that uh, we should go to a place where I can also eat. And when they order drinks, they know that they only order for themselves and not for me. And I think it's very good to say because they are really understanding. Even when I met Jam and we said we would eat somewhere, I told him like, oh, I don't eat meat and I don't eat chicken. And we went to a halal restaurant. So uh, you should always tell them in advance. Don't keep it secret and yeah, yeah, right. tell them after meeting. Yeah. Korean people are understand you if you mm. if you say that. Yeah. Yeah. So don't worry about mm. that. Korean people are understand you if you say that. Yeah. So don't worry about that. Korean people are understand you if you say that. Person is asking like psychology wise and financially wise, what is it like being an exchange student in Korea? And uh, we already covered the financial part. So about the psychology part, I would like to say that. Uh, going to a foreign country for six months. Hi, how are you? Hi. What is your name? Luca. Luca? Nice shake your hand. I am Rimi. Rimi. How old is <laughs> about the psychology part, uh, it is really hard to go to a foreign country for six months because you really have to get used to a different environment and you are going to meet a lot of new people. So if you have troubles making new friends, then you should really try to practice and be more extroverted because it will be really hard to survive by yourself if you don't know anyone and if you don't know the language. And studying by itself is hard already, so you should find ways to make it easier for yourself. <laughs> Have you ever been to the Netherlands? No, not yet. Do you want to go? Yeah, sure, I want to go. Why? To see you. No! The Netherlands is where? Why are you? Cheese. Cheese. Amsterdam. Oh, Amsterdam. I want to go to Amsterdam. Oh, why? I heard it's really beautiful. Orange. Orange? Orange Kundan. Ah. Chukku. Soccer. Soccer. Yeah. And Tobin. Ajax. And uh, this person also asks if I would like to come back to Korea after mm -hmm. uh, going back to the Netherlands. So after going back to the Netherlands, I have to finish my program. I still have one year left to study and mm. after that I will hopefully graduate. Oh. And after that I would love to come back to Korea because I have friends here and I like Korea very much. We answered so, so we answered some questions that you asked in Lumis Instagram. I hope it will be helpful to you. So, oh, and this place is really beautiful. So maybe if you come to Korea, maybe I think you should come to yeah, like Yonsei University. Thank you for watching. So, get it started. Toasting. 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 Toasting.